I already own Touch of Pink or Touch of Berry or Touch of something. I don't know. I already own one of these, but I wanted to pick up a second color. Andrew here and welcome back to the channel. If you are new to the channel, welcome. Thanks so much for stopping by. I hope you will stick around and click that subscribe button down below. It is the bright red one that matches my lip color. So today, as you can see by the title, I am here with another elf haul. Yes, my friends, another elf haul. Because as I promised, I was going to do a full review um, of some of the makeup products. I was going to do a one brand review four elf products but they keep freaking coming out with new products so every time I have enough to do stuff then they keep coming out with more and I want to be updated so I've officially given up and and just I've accepted that this is the stuff that I have and I'm not going to be able to do anymore so if you want to see what I picked up in this batch of elf products then just keep watching thanks guys ourselves a little bag right here with some good stuff now a lot of this is lip products but every time I've ordered you see the dust of the screen okay anyway so every oh hello let me let it readjust so every time that I order something I always end up getting one of those like gifts things that they do so I end up with extra stuff but it helps because now I have some stuff to give away to you guys and I also have some more products to try that I didn't actually order so actually those are super helpful for me and getting a broad range from their $1 stuff all the way up to their more expensive stuff. It used to be just $1 or $3, but now they have $5 stuff and $10 stuff, so I'm actually gonna have to pay attention when I review this stuff for you guys. So, let's jump in. So, let's sure. I'm gonna go ahead and just pull the receipt out here so I can remember what I ordered and what came in the gift set. Okay. So part of the reason from this haul came from these, which are the Velvet Matte Lipsticks. They came back into stock and I really wanted to try these for you guys because I've heard people speak highly of them, uh, particularly Coffee Break with Danny. And so I think I have, I think there's only five shades and I picked up four and then I just ordered the one that I was missing because it just came back in stock. Um, so do you guys want to see like a full video on just the like, review and swatches of these separate from the brand review? Um, let me know that in the comments. But anyway, so I picked up um, the Velvet Matte Lipstick in Fuchsia Fantasy in Ruby Red in Dark Brown and in Flirty Flamingo. And then the other one is also a brown lipstick. What is the name of that one? It's going to bother me. Let me look. Oh, you guys, my color pop just came. The other lipstick is in blushing brown. So I will have one, two, three, four, five of them. So I might just do a separate video. Let me know if you want to see that in the comment section below. All right. Then I also picked up the Beautifully Bare Satin Lipstick in Touch of Nude. I already own Touch of Pink or Touch of Berry or Touch of something. I don't know. I already own one of these, but I wanted to pick up a second color. I also picked up, just for kicks and giggles, the um, Beautifully Precise Precision Point Tweezers because I'm always looking for a good pair of tweezers and these were like $3 so if they work well, we're good to go. And I also picked up the Beautifully Bare 3-in-1 Makeup Base in Clear because like I mentioned, I do want to do like a one brand tutorial as well so I needed a primer and I thought I would go with one of the new ones. Card. So this is one of the things that came in the the gift. The, it was like a lip gift or something. I don't know what this has to do with lips, but this is the Wrinkle Refiner in Clear. So I'm very curious about this. So, hmm. Anyway, so 
We're not gonna redo things now. They're coming soon, I promise. This was also something from the gift. This is the Elf Shimmer in Gold. So this is one of their like lower end products. Um, not from their like elite collection or whatever that's in the black packaging. Although they keep changing things on me, so I don't even know. Then I got, this also came from the kit, which I'm really excited to try. This is the Pout Perfector in Glow. Now it looks like there's some glitter in this, so I don't know how I feel about that, but I'm excited to give it a go, so, because it looks pretty. And I don't recall seeing this before, so I'm excited about that. Um, then I did order this. This is the Beautifully Bare Lightweight Concealer Stick in Fair Light. And I did swatch this and it looks a little on the yellow side, so I don't know how well this is going to work for me. Um, I might try to pick up the liquid concealer as well before I do the review, just so I have a well-rounded situation of their concealers. But I did pick up that. And let's see. And everything else um, in here came from the gift. So they also sent the Mineral Lipstick in Beautiful Berry. I don't know if I own this or not. I may already own this. They also sent a couple of brushes in that. The Retractable Lip Brush. That one's one of their um, $3 brushes. Then they sent the e.l.f. Powder Brush, which is from their $1 collection. And they also sent the e.l.f. Kiss Balm in XO Red. And I did just get in a Target box or something um, a different color. So I may try one of these and give one of these away to you guys. So that's everything that was in this e.l.f. haul. So really be sure to subscribe so you do not miss the e.l.f. brand review. I promise that is coming sooner rather than later. But I have a lot of products to try out and forum surveys on. So you may see one, maybe more videos related to these e.l.f. products. So don't forget to subscribe so you don't miss those future videos. And if you enjoyed this video, please be sure to give it a thumbs up and subscribe if you haven't done so already. And I will see you guys in my next video. Bye guys.